Peace. Infinite waters. Diving deep once again. Beautiful deep divers. We are out here in the heart of nature, baby. Jurassic Park. Now, deep divers. Do you have a problem with how you see yourself? With your self-image? Are you like Ralph? I don't think I'm that good. I don't think I'm that worthy. I don't think I'm that brilliant. Well, deep divers, it is time to start changing the way we see ourselves. Start changing our self-image. How to improve your self-image and stop caring what other people think. Deep divers, let's just, woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. We got the birds up there. Now I'm sending you tons of positive energy right now. Take that, take that, take that. Especially if you don't like what you see. Is that you, deep diver? You wake up, you look at yourself in the mirror, and you're like, I'm not impressed. A lot of people have anxiety on the planet. A lot of people have a low self-esteem and it's all because of how they see themselves. After this video, you are gonna see yourself in the best way possible. We are gonna improve the self-image. We are gonna stop caring what other people think and we ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello? <laughs> Beautiful deep divers, life is great. I'm grateful. And I know a lot about self-image. There was a time in my life when I didn't like what I saw. I wanted to be someone else. Then I realized, wait a minute, Ralph. It's because you've been programmed. And all of us, have been programmed to what true beauty is, what success is, what it means to be wealthy, what it means to be popular in society. So a lot of us, it's no surprise that we don't feel worthy, but I'm here to tell you, you are so worthy. So how did I begin changing the way I saw myself. How did I begin changing my self-image? A lot of us, we are investing in other people's opinions. We are not investing in how we see ourselves. Oh, if I wear this, will they like what they see? No, 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 no. Do I like what I see? That's how to improve your self-image. Don't do it for them, do it for you. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. Dress for yourself because it makes you feel good. Live the life you wanna live because it's making you happy. To improve your self-image, you have to stop living according to society's expectations and rigid standards. So I learned over time, Deep Divers, to invest in how I saw myself. And that means you have to take time out from other people's views on you, their opinions on you, their thoughts on you. Like when I'm making these videos, I'm having a great time. Life is fantastic. I love to do this, and that's how I improve my self-image. You have to also look at it like this, deep divers. A lot of us, we are investing in material possessions more than we invest in our own peace of mind. That's why we have anxiety. That's why we have a low self-esteem. So I said, okay, I love material possessions, but I love my peace of mind even more. So instead of just trying to buy stuff to impress people who don't actually care, <laughs> I'm gonna start investing in my peace of mind. I'm gonna make sure I'm happy with how I see myself. And what I did was make a habit every single day, I was doing this for years, 
coming into nature, meditating, sitting with myself and my emotions, creating a better relationship with myself. You see, a lot of us, we have created a war within ourselves because we don't accept ourselves. We're begging for other people, please accept me. But we don't accept ourselves. To improve your self-image, you have to accept yourself. Screw everybody else. And that's what I was doing in nature years ago. I was learning how to love myself again. I was learning how to accept myself. And therefore, deep divers, I see myself in the best way imaginable. I love myself, I accept myself. What you think of me has no bearing on who I'm becoming. Mm, what? Slow motion this side. Mm, why? Because I am my best friend. That's what happens when you invest in your peace of mind. That's what happens when you invest in the relationship with yourself. You become your best friend. In other words, Woo! You start clapping for yourself. You become your greatest fan. And that's how to improve your self-image and stop caring what other people think. A lot of us, we are living through our persona. Our personas, which is the mask, this person, the job we have, how much money, how much money we make, where we live. All of these things are concepts constructs and illusions and that's why a lot of people have anxiety and a low self-esteem we have to realize we are multi-dimensional beings having a human experience we are even more than a self-image we are even more than how we perceive ourselves but to improve your self-image and to stop caring what other people think you have to realize your perception rules your perception rules. Your perception rules because it creates your reality. So I started to realize that the perception I have of myself is actually greater than the perception the cat down the road has of me. Like, I don't care what the cat down the road thinks of me. Honestly, deep, honestly, deep divers. <laughs> I care how I see myself. I don't care how my next door neighbor perceives me because once again, it's not gonna change anything within myself. What will change is how I perceive myself. What does Ralph Smart think of Ralph Smart? That's everything. And every single day I make a conscious choice to see myself in the best possible way. How do I do this? By being kind to myself. You are spending more time with yourself than anybody else Therefore, the words you say to yourself are so essential. They have to be uplifting. They have to inspire you. They have to be encouraging you. You have to be gentle with yourself because once again, you have to live with you. If you can learn that, now you will improve your self-image. You will, in essence, stop caring what other people think too. Once you learn how to speak gently to yourself, kind words once you learn how to have compassion for yourself you improve your self-image i know what it's like a lot of us we're on social media on the gram on youtube on all of these sites and we're comparing ourselves to other people this is the new world and there is a big epidemic on the planet with anxiety why because you're comparing you're comparing somebody's subscribe account to yours not realizing both of you have a different journey. Don't compare your chapter one to my chapter 20. So I've learned over time that comparison is the greatest thief of joy. We have to learn how to stop comparing ourselves to other people. They aren't us and we aren't them. How did I learn how to do this? Seven day vegan challenge. Like I'm eating the plant-based diet a vegan of over 13 years, but I meet other vegans and they're like eating totally different from me. But that's cool because now I actually learn how to appreciate them. And that's why the only time comparison is actually healthy is when it's used for inspiration. To improve your self-image, stop comparing your body to theirs. Who cares if they've got bigger muscles than you? Who cares, ladies, if her butt's bigger than yours? 
and her milkshake brings all the boys to the club. <laughs> right? You are you. You gotta love your body. You gotta love what you're eating. Everybody has a natural body shape and size and it's all beautiful. Everybody is also gonna be eating different foods. Everyone has different tastes. I don't like watermelons, but I love grapes full of resveratrols, improving my cardiovascular health so we can all get along once we appreciate each other's unique differences. To improve your self-image, it's time to start honoring your uniqueness. In other words, you have to learn how to own your weirdness. You own your weirdness when you learn how to give yourself your own unique definition. Screw society's definition of you when you learn how to define who you are. I am who I say I am. When you learn to get comfortable in your weirdness, don't be afraid to be the weirdo that you are. There is nobody like Ralph Smart on the planet. That's why I thrive. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. And that's why I see myself with unconditional positive self acceptance and self love. So realize, stop running away from the weirdo that you are and say, actually, I love the person who I'm becoming. And then you'll just say, feel so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello? <laughs> Beautiful deep divers, we are out here chillaxing in the heart of nature, baby. Just, woo, breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Who else is gonna do that? Exactly, there's only one Ralph Smart. There's only one you too. An original is always worth more than a copy. Deep divers, let's just breathe in that good ass prana again, again, and again. Shout out to everybody who's been getting the good ass prana shirts, looking so super duper fly. RalphSmart.com slash clothes. You got a question? Instagram at Infinite Waters. Deep divers, have a beautiful day. Infinite Waters diving deep once again. Stay well, stay healthy, peace. You, there's nobody like me. Exactly.